it start? Is it on our spindle? Okay, currently it's running at 3,000 RPM. Now come around and that's your actual spindle speed, 29. So 20 is 3,000. Then down below you can see the, I've got it set 3,000. I'm gonna run the spindle down. Slow it down to 1,500. Look here, Judy, you get 1500, and then it says 1500 up here. It's running quiet, it's running smooth. I'm going to run it all the way down to, I'll take it down to, uh, let's take it to 20. Now I'm zero in on it. So it's currently rotating at 20 RPM. I'm going to increase the speed. There's 550. I'll take it on up. There's a thousand. There's two thousand. Nice and smooth, no noise. And we're gonna take it on up to three thousand. Three thousand RPM. Again here, there, and there. So you have to actually spin the speed, okay, and then zero on the spin. And then I'm going to go ahead and slow it down, stop it. Slow it down, 700, 400, zero. Good. The uh, spindle, we'll just put it handle and manual. Uh, we'll, see, we'll set it at 10 RPM. Start. I'll go ahead and ramp it up. 30, 100, 700 RPM. Nice and quiet, smooth. Now, currently it has the three jaw chuck in it. It does have the collet chuck that matches the other one that comes with the machine. And the uh, collet tool is a parts catcher box we'll change into collins. Uh, we'll change direction. Uh, let me go um, stop. I'll run it down a little bit. Stop the spindle. I'm going to reverse the spindle. Start going the other direction. I'm at 200. I'll take it down to I'll take it down to 20 RPM. Nice and smooth. Ramp it up, 430, 700. I haven't warmed the spindle up. I don't want to go over 7 RPM. Nice and smooth. Both spindles are very nice. Uh, in I'll index the turret while we're here. Judy, you want to walk this way and go around behind me, and I'll index this turret so they can see it index. directions. Now currently it's got stationary tool holders in it. This machine does come with three live tool holders uh, that attach to this spindle for live tooling. Okay, that should be good. Um, Alright, let's go ahead and uh, reference the axes. We'll reference the X. Reference the Z. Next is zero. And now Z is zero. Okay, stop the video.